Vanderwaals forces are a type of secondary bonding. They are much weaker than primary bonds, but present everywhere. These forces arise from instantaneous or induced dipoles in the electron clouds of atoms and molecules. Even non-polar atoms like noble gases can attract each other for short times through Van der Waals interactions. They are universal, acting in all materials, and they play an especially important role in layered materials like graphite and molybdenum disulfide. In graphite, the carbon atoms within a sheet are bonded strongly through covalent bonds, but the sheets are held together only by weak Van der Waals forces. This is why graphite layers can easily slide, making it useful as a lubricant and in pencils. Van der Waals forces are also responsible for adhesion and absorption at surfaces, as well as the stability of polymers, soft materials, and many biological systems. While their energy is small compared to covalent or ionic bonds, typically just a few kilojoules per mole, collectively, they can strongly influence material properties. So, Van der Waals forces show us that even the weakest interactions can have major effects, especially when we consider large number of atoms and molecules together.